What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Nick and today I'm bringing you guys another of my legendary or epic uh, heroic weapon tutorials. Not tutorials, but class setups and what I actually got through my supply drops. Uh, so I finally got a grease gun variant, I absolutely adore the grease gun. I've been using it for on and off, like it's been good for a couple days and then it's been bad for a couple days and it's been good a couple days. It's just me, it's not, it's not the gun, but uh, the gun is just absolutely amazing. So this is the, gun, uh, the kit that I got. I got the gun, uh, candy kit for it. It looks just amazing. The iron sight changes up a little bit and it's like gold and black, which is like really, really clean. And I got the torch too as well for my pistol, which is also good. Like I got the extended max and like, there's like 16 or 12 rounds in it. So it's pretty decent as well. You can kill two or three people with it if you're accurate with the pistol. Uh, so what we're using on the grease gun is something that I really doesn't use a lot on SMGs and that is advanced rifling which gives you a little bit more range and more control door like accuracy on range and more damage on range I think. Uh, so we are also using the quick drop because this gun's like zoom in or aim in or like aim down sight is really really slow compared to all the other submachine guns so it's kind of useful to have that. Also had rapid fire on, rapid fire is such a great stuff to have on your guns because you do a lot more damage on close quarters. and. As I said, like I have the advanced rifling, so I usually just tap on long ranges, so I don't use a lot of ammo, or just use up my whole magazine, so that's pretty decent as well. And we got the grip to compensate with the rapid fire, and actually be a little bit better at range as well as the advanced rifling. So it's a pretty, pretty good setup, and I like this. I was using infantry for extra ammo, and the extra attachment spots, which is absolutely amazing. And I'm using prime, that actually gives you one extra attachment slot as well, and it reduces flinch. So it's probably the best basic training perk in the game in my opinion. So let's take a look at this thing and see how it looks. This is how it looks. It looks a little bit worn down right now because it's not the uh, it's not the fullest one or it's not the uh, best one. It's just the candy one. Like it's not the candy mark two. So I guess the uh, candy mark two would look a little bit cleaner or in another cold skin. So it looks absolutely amazing. Got a little scar uh, star on it, like with the magazine like that. And it's just this color scheme and so on. It's amazing with it. As you see the iron sight is just absolutely gorgeous as well. It's really clean. As I said, I think I said that quite a lot, but it's a pretty, pretty good looking iron sight in this gun. And yeah, you can see how fast it shoots. Like, it shoots fast, but still does like contain the ammo in the magazine and they still have a really good range and it's really easy to control. And it does a lot of damage. So I'm gonna hop into a free for all game with this gun and I'm gonna show you guys how the gun really, really works. and. How I like it and how I play with it, I'm probably going to be a little bit cautious and try and sound for a little bit more, so be prepared for that. So yeah, I'll see you guys in when I get into into free-for-all game, so I'll see ya then. Alright, so here we are in a game of free-for-all on St. Moth, or whatever it's called. It's a little bit of a long name on this, game, on this map, so we're going to try and play a little bit of a free-for-all with the Grease Gun, the variant that I just showed you guys, and uh, I love the Iron Sight in this variant. And I love the gun as well. I'm gonna put the but I don't know where he is. He's underneath me, isn't he? Oh, there's a lot of people around here, but I don't know where. I think they're up here, maybe. Hello? Nope. Oh, thank you, good sir. Trying to nade us, so they're probably trying to come up to us now, right? I need a UAV. Once we get a UAV, we should be pretty set. Free for all is uh, it's cool in this game. Because uh, it's really simple, it's not too like complicated. So it is something that you could just pick up and play and just enjoy yourself. To be honest with this gun, which is what is fun about this game, that you can play it like really hardcore and sometimes you can play it like really try hard here, so I do enjoy that. This guy has a shotgun, that kind of sucks, but that's okay. What are you doing in the corner, bro? Why are you in the corner? I have footsteps over here. Oh my god, the STG or whatever that thought was, but yeah. If you guys are wondering what setup and so on, what I'm playing with, like sensitivity and so on in class setup, you just let me know and I'll make sure to make a video about it. 
what I think is the best for me. Like, it might be different for you what you like to use, but this is at least what I like to use. It's working out for me pretty decent. Like, some days I have, like, incredible games. Oh, you don't. Is there a guy around here? There he is. But where did he go, though? Shotgun guy, I don't like you. You can bug off. I'm trying to get this, uh... UAV in the air that could potentially help us a lot. I'm trying to just look around this place where there possibly could be people right over there. So it seems to be like every time I move to another side of the map, they just move with me, like they just move away from me. So that's kind of not upsetting, I would say, but it's kind of annoying. A little bit. I got that one. We've got a bomb as well that we can call in. I'm just gonna try. I don't got the speaks that I usually run on because I just prestiged. Oh, I have footsteps. Sound in this game is so easy, especially in a game mod that's like free for all. Artillery ready for orders. Waiting This guy. This guy. Oh, I have footsteps. I want to call my streaks, but I'm not going to lay down and get killed. That doesn't sound like a great idea. Let's go with this one. Just having a little bit more range. This gun is good enough for like how it is, so... Not a big difference. We got one. And then let's just do this. Oh, we barely got that guy, or... Yeah. I'm playing a little bit cautious just because I'm trying to... I'm trying to get used to sound whoring and all that good stuff, so... Yeah. I have footsteps. Oh, we got prone block, and there's the shotgun. Oh my god. Level 8, let's go. Like free fall is it a good level up or ranking or is it good for XP? Might be, might be. You know, it's the first time I'm actually trying free fall. Oh my god! There's Ash people a lot in this game. He's free and A, so no wonder he plays like that. He had no health. At least we got him. God damn it! Now we're starting to just die a lot, which I don't really like. It's not sound whoring, I think that's the reason. What? Okay, that's fine. Fine. Oh, get destroyed. Get destroyed. Get that over there. Oh, is that a guy? No. Free Fall is a lot of fun. It feels like an old school card when I play Free Fall. Like, it feels like one level 3 and one level 2. Which is a good thing. Beautiful range kill. There we go. There we go. My phone is going up as well. That sucks. 30, 30 kills, 7. Really, really good score. I don't know how this guy got the first or got the play of the game, but that's okay. Probably. It's probably just like.
I don't know. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed. Anyway, it's a beautiful, beautiful gun. That is like it's absolutely amazing. The grease gun in that variant is looking awesome. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe as it really helps me out. And I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Bye bye. Take care.